Emporia police say a call for shots fired inside the restaurant came into 911 communications around 8.30 Wednesday night. Police arrive, go inside, and find the owner dead. He had uh, multiple gunshot wounds. Then they locate the son. Multiple gunshot, uh, gunshot wounds to him. He was flown out to uh, VCU uh, Medical Center. Police say the son is able to give them valuable information. He was able to um, tell, uh, give description of the suspect. For those who ate at this restaurant regularly, the shootings and death, they say, since. Wow. Goddamn, um, goddamn tigers got hit up, man. That's the jankiest looking um, China, Chinese restaurant. You know they got some good food. <laughs> These are the best Chinese restaurants to go to, man. These little hole in the wall ones, but they real rude and shit. You going in, they, they act like they mad you came in there. What you want? What you want? Okay, four, four wing fries or, or fish fries? Fries. Okay. Steak and cheese? Everything on? Everything on? Everything on it. Okay. All right, y'all ought to be up in five minutes. 1949. Got it. And then when you come back and get your shit, they throw it at you. Fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, Neil. Those are the best ones, man. They got the best food. Man. If they nice, man, their food suck, man. You got to go in there, man, where they mean at, man. Gunshot, uh, gunshot wounds to him. He was flown out to uh, VCU uh, Medical Center. Police say the son is able to give them valuable information. He was able to um, tell, uh, give description of the suspect. For those who ate at this restaurant regularly, the shootings and death, they say, senseless. The last time I was here, he told me he was the father wanted to retire and sell the business, and now he's passed away. It's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. It's very sad. It's like so senseless. Jackie Dickens drives. You know you in the country. That's the country right there. Everybody fat. <laughs> Everybody fat in the country, man. These people, all these people in their 50s, man. <laughs> these people in their 50s, man. Very sad. It's like so senseless. Jackie Dickens drives 30 minutes just to eat here. So my son introduced me to this place years ago when he knew them from Franklin, Virginia. About 12 hours after the shootings, Emporia police went to this mobile home and they arrested Sean Rice. His charges include first degree murder, use of a firearm. Yo, that's a fucking trailer park. They got black people in the trailer park. Uh oh. Because I listen, trailer parks aren't usually violent, man. Man, you got black folk in trailer parks? Goddamn, watch out, man. Damn, you got black folk living in trailer parks now. Fuck. <laughs> Sean Rice, yeah, that's that name. That's troubling, man. I'm troubled by that name. <laughs> Virginia. About 12 hours after the shootings, Emporia police went to this mobile home and they arrested Sean Rice. His charges include first degree murder, use of a firearm by a felon, and aggravated malicious wounding. While police believe robbery was the motive, they also say the suspect used to work at the restaurant. Uh -oh. He was a former employee at China Garden. 
Um, and he, what I understand, he was fired from from employment about two, maybe three weeks ago. Yeah, man, you fired, son, man. You in trouble, Jack. Don't be go, don't go on fire. Don't be doing the fire them sons, man. I don't know, man. Sean Rice might not be a son, man. I'm hoping, man. Ooh, this Sean benefit of the doubt, man. Don't be firing no son, man, though, man. You know the best way to avoid having to fire a son, man? Chat, help me out. What's the best way to avoid having to fire a son, man, chat? <laughs> What's the best way to avoid having to fire a son, man, chat? He's <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> yeah, don't hire him, man. <laughs> don't hire him in the first place, man. <laughs> Listen, man, I ain't never seen no Chinese store that had no black people working there, man. I don't know what the fuck these, these tigers were thinking about, man. <laughs> Listen, man, you go to every single Chinese food store in the DMV area. Anybody here from the DMV, man? Hit one of you from the DMV, man. Anybody in here from the DMV, man? <laughs> Listen, man. I ain't never, ever, 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 ever. Seen no Negro working in no carryout, man. And I mean never. Ever. He said the DM. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Not the debauch of the motor vehicles, man. No. I ain't never. I ain't never seen no son man working at the goddamn carry up. I don't know what the fuck these these motherfuckers was thinking about. Rice. His charges include first degree murder, use of a firearm by a felon, and aggravated malicious wounding. While police believe robbery was the motive, they also say the suspect used to work at the restaurant. He was a former employee at China Garden, um, and he, what I understand, he was fired from. From employment about two maybe three weeks ago almost everyone i spoke to said they knew the family so well they're shocked by what has happened and they all say they just wish the suspect would have taken the money and gone in emporia wayne coval cbs six news